Hello everyone, my name is Fungusen and welcome back to this Imperator Rome Reverse Alexander campaign, or as it is also known, Red Naxala. So, I've had a bit of a look between the episodes and I've compiled a list of what religions we have. So, we have already sort of, uh, well, the ones we have in our country at the moment is, that we have holy sites for, is Hellenic. Kemetic, Jewish, Canaanite, I don't know how to pronounce any of these things, Chaldean, Hindu, Buddhist, and Jain, which is eight in total. In addition to this, we have definitely desecrated the Arabic one, because we did that in the, next, uh, in the previous episode. <clears throat> uh, so that's eight plus one, which is nine. We need to do ten in total. Luckily for us, we do have here, which is a Sibylian holy site instead. So in our next war against um, Phrygia, uh, Cappadocia should come in because they are a satrapy. So we should be able to get this one here. Now I can't remember specifically which one of the ones we have in our uh, realm that we have desecrated previously. But we can just go through them and desecrate them again. That that's, doesn't really matter. <clears throat> So that's part A. Um, part B, we also have an achievement called, not that one, uh, where is it, Garum Nobile, which I presume means, I don't know, anyway. Uh, we need to produce a surplus of 10 fish. I've had a brief look around, I'm not actually sure whether there is a better way of doing this, it's something in the ledger. Provinces? No. This gives uh, good trade. If I can find trade, trade overview. So this is of no use to anyone. What happens if I click? No. Okay, yeah, this is uh, pointless. Anyway, um, so I had a look. I haven't clicked on every single one, but we do have a glorious province Somewhere... Do I not have the trade goods? Yeah, trade goods. Where's the fish? This one. So this one produces eight currently. Um, so we need two more if I understand correctly. And this one is each... Every seven slave pop will produce one additional fish. Seven times nine would be 63. If we move eight more people here, it should be okay. Let's try it anyway. Might need to move even more, but doesn't really matter. Okay. So, we should move them from... What the frick is Kolkoi? Uh, province. Let's move from another province. Like... You... Doesn't say how many, but sure it'll be fine. Thirty-one iron. We don't need that much iron for sure. Okay, they're a bit um, <clears throat> annoyed at the moment, but that gives ten fish. Now, if we check achievements. Number of goods produced is greater than 10. Well, you are going to get slightly upset here, I feel, but okay. More than 10 it is, so we're going to push even more people in here. And then they'll starve to death a bit, but that, that's all for the you know, greater good. Um, preferably not from Tandia. Um, although it kind of looks like that's the only option we have, unless we go and steal more of that iron producing, which I think is fine. We don't need all that iron. Oh, they're all from iron, from Kurana. I thought we had somewhere... 
else. I'm clearly mad. But okay. Eleven? Um, right. So that one should trigger now. And yeah, then they'll be slightly upset, but that's all fine. Okay, we do need a new governor here. Um, kind of want to save you for something else. Um, who are you? You, my son. I mean, you are pretty good. Um... Sure, let's go for some nepotism. Right, that's that. So, what else? Um, tempted to make some local armies here, just in case we get any slave revolt. So let's actually get that sorted as well. Let's build an archer there, and let's build an archer here, and we will assign them to the regions afterwards. Right, uh, next thing, all of you need to go up there to get ready for um, our next war with. Let's just spread them out slightly for now and we'll sort them once they're all up here. <clears throat> and get ready for our next war with Phrygia. So, we have two options here. I'm not sure whether our uh, truce is over. It is not over. Okay, we have one option here, which would be to declare war on this guy. That will then bring in Phrygia, which will bring in Aeolia. We don't want to declare war on these guys directly, because it will bring in both Macedon and Phrygia. Now, Phrygia will then still bring in all of their, you know, tiny people, so it will be a massive amount of armies everywhere to fight, so... I think we'll go this route. We'll still be able to take, um... Well, we could still probably piece out Aeolia separately, so that should be fine. And yeah, and then we'll just go from there. Then we'll have a border with Macedon, we can declare on them. And in doing that actually get Athens. Uh, apart from that, you, my friend, uh, still in road building mode, go and build the road to Memphis. I'm not sure, we might have a road. The vast majority of the stretch there, but hey-ho. And yes, you are starving as always. Um, not sure if there's really anything I can do. You already import stuff. What are you importing? Yeah, food. Literally have no province producing food here at all. Oh, do we have free? We do have free province investments. Well, I know where you're going. Um, not there. Here. So let's go for uh, local import routes. Hmm. And while we're at it. We have two theaters here. I'm kind of tempted to bump this up. Three more theaters. Oh, five more temples. And some more aqueducts. You just get stuff actually being converted. That should speed that up considerably. Okay, um... I think that's it. Yeah. Let's speed things up while we are... Oh my god. Yes, thank you. 38 whole ducats for local unrest. That's exactly what I wanted. Uh, political influence is looking fantabulous though. Uh, do we have enough? I can't remember the exact cost. Can we defy a ruler? Uh, 260, okay. Well, another few months. and Then we'll be able to do that. Okay, we do have our archer here. So you, my friend, are going to be assigned to the region, and we are going to recruit some more people to you. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. 
One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And sure, you can have a couple of supply trains as well. Didn't I build one down here as well? Did you get picked up by someone on the way? Mm. I don't want to lose political influence. Yeah. I see no reason to do anything differently there. <clears throat> Ouch. Who are you? You are the Daurika. Has it come to our attention that a trusted advisor, blah, 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 has been siphoning funds? Oh dear. Um, we can imprison him. He will lose loyalty. He will gain corruption. We will gain popularity. We don't have enough to actually use it at the moment. We get a massive amount of money. Um, well. So sorry to hear that. Um, in your place, a new one shall rise. This guy. Fantastic. Yes, you can have incense, and with the money we can get a few more inventions. Fort defense, army weight modifier sounds pretty nice. I mean, chore. Uh, maintenance cost. I mean, yeah, it should be. I mean, in theory, it will pay for itself eventually. I can't seem to help. But feel that one of my archers got swallowed up. I. What? Oh, no, no, that's the road building one. Yes, you for some reason managed to steal one of the archers. I don't know how you did it, but fine. Um, you. Going to go back down there then we'll see right and you got confused because reasons right uh, or did he already have these amount of troops 37 sounds wrong um All right, uh, we'll see. <clears throat> it doesn't matter that much anyway. Uh, yes, import salt. Okay. Um, boom, boom, boom. Yes, that is fine. We're still building those, so that should be okay. How did I lose a horse? Very confused here. Okay, you get another horse and you will march up. You can probably be somewhere there. This is highly confusing in general, but okay. Alright, we do have you here now. We can assign you to the region. And build you some more troops here as well. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. 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 One, two. Okay. That should make those regions fine. Um, you seem to have managed to get caught on stuff again. So, yeah. This is these guys, so let's put put one over here, and you can go and siege that, and you can go over here with the rest of them. Right, so that's everyone. You are there, you will be there, 
We do have you building a road. You're assigned to this region, which I presume does not reach up there. Nope. You are my elephant guy. Send elephant guy over there as well. Okay. Sorry, I don't think this episode is going to be super exciting, unfortunately. Do you have 20 horses now? I am... Um, Clearly, I must be losing my mind or something. Right, okay. You're done. That's done. This place. Okay, we do get the free province investment on that one. That is Prague something. Luckily, there's only one with that name. So you needed two training camps? Yes, okay, you're done. Breads and circuses. Um, Taliputra needs marketplace and two libraries. Okay. Yeah, not doing that. That should be it. Okay, great. Right. Three troops are going over there. You are going to stay here and deal with stuff. You are building a road. You are moving up. I think I might have sent one too many. You are going to this one and... I sent both of you up there. No, you're going away. Okay, you can stay over here and deal with stuff over there. Okay. I think we're good now. Sorry. <laughs> right, that's part done. Um, we are doing that. We are dealing with that. Yes. Everything is perfectly under control. We do have enough to do this. Um, how long is this going to last? December of 63. No, let's just go ahead and so deify another ruler. Do we care which one? Does it matter? Kuhn the Besieger? I mean, who sounds the Asian? Oh, that's us. No, I think we'll save ourselves for that one in case we live that long. So you have been... Where did we see that? It's too disloyal. Oh, none of them have any. Alright. Nice, so one more. <clears throat> and then we'll be able to do that as well. Okay, excellent. So now we can also... Uh, Influence someone again. I mean, this guy seems fine to do that. So let's just keep doing that and see if he decides to want some more manpower. I mean, we are just drowning in manpower anyway. You're the governor of some place. Um, he can gain more corruption. He is pretty corrupt. Um... Remove him. How much power level do you wield? Basically nothing. Okay. What, 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 what? Who's scorned now? Vata. That is this one. Well, I'm going to remove him anyway. And let's see. Who can we put in place here? Okay, you are disloyal now. Fine. You will go there. We also need a thing for this. You seem like a fine... There we go. Sorted. 
Jesus Christ. Okay. Everyone seems to be in position up here. You're building a road. You are not doing anything. Right. You are that guy. You're on your way to fight things over here. Um, actually, you should capture this stuff here. Because... Yeah, so we just have the ticking war score. <clears throat> okay. Just wait to the 1st of November, slow down, and just go to war. Hi, Phrygia. Ah, I mean, I'm fairly certain Phrygia doesn't like me, but I do not like them either, so you should not be shocking. Um, <laughs> uh, terrible joke. <coughs> Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> okay, so this is the province we want to go to. Let's just go straight there. Um, I'm not sure whether this one has realized yet. No, they haven't been called in yet. Um, you will have been called in though, so let's just wait today. You called in yet? No, come on. You telling me it's not going to be called in? There we go, thank you. Uh, you'll go there, you can go and siege down that. And we should be good to go. I should really build some more forts here though. Oh wait, this is my forts taking those over. Never mind, pay no attention to what I'm saying. Okay, that is a pretty nice battle. Sieging away is going fine there. And that's obviously a glorious battle as well. And now we're going to deal with all of these freaking armies. Um, a yes, thank you. Which is going to be a massive, massive pain. Um, maybe you should swap. Let's send you up there and you can go and fight these ones um, as they come. So, yeah. Alright. Let's just go. Now we own this, we can desecrate this, and this is Sibylene. And just to make sure I do not forget, I'm going to write this down, Sibylene. So yeah, that means we should have enough for that. Okay, great. Has this achievement triggered, by the way, and I haven't? Yes, it has. Okay, there we go. Fantastic. Right, uh, and thank you for coming and suiciding on top of my fort. We are running deception uh, skirmishing. Oh, you're running away now. Ah, oh, for the... Okay, it doesn't... Who was it? General or something? Nope. Okay, then we're fine. Uh, right. Let's just keep going then. Yes. Ah, oh, you're running away. Come on. It's not fair. Is that a fort? Well, where is the fort somewhere that seems to be? It is a fort. We should still be able to go here though, because it's my land. <clears throat> Alright, and you have taken that. Let's see if we can take that one down. For some reason we managed to skip over each other here. Um, which is fine. I guess you can go and siege that fort meanwhile. Uh, Pirates Ahoy! Um, yeah. Sure you can deal with it. Oh, this is going to be interesting. If he crosses over here while I'm sieging it, he's going to get absolutely smashed. Alright. Uh, but yeah. 
I think that is it for this episode, though. So, next one, well, considering how the wars against Phrygia usually take more than one episode, I'm not going to promise that we'll finish into the next one, but we will try. Anyways, apart from that, if you are enjoying the, the series, feel free to leave a like, comment, and or subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!